Now, weather with Chief Meteorologist Jamie Warner. Really nice evening across the Ozarks. Kind of an early taste of those summer evenings that we enjoy sitting out on the patio. Temperatures right now in the low 70s. Winds light out of the south southwest at six miles per hour and a touch of humidity out there. It's not overly humid, but you can certainly sense it with dew points right now in the low 60s. Here's a peek at the afternoon highs. We made it into the 80s area wide 84 today in Springfield. One of our warmest readings so far this year, but not the warmest. Remember back in April, we had that one day on the 10th where it got real warm, uh, and that was when most of the area had their warmest readings of the year so far, with the exception of West Plains. West Plains hit 86 this afternoon. It looks like we could challenge or best those numbers tomorrow afternoon as readings will likely be a degree or two warmer than they were today. It's a quiet scene across most of the region. We did have some active weather earlier this afternoon, especially across southeast Missouri and in northeast Arkansas. We had one severe storm to the west of West Plains that generated some flash flooding potential and maybe some hail and gusty winds. That threat for severe weather shifted into south, into uh, northeast Arkansas and has since faded now with the setting sun and the cooling temperatures outside right now. We've got starry skies. We're going to hold on to mild temperatures temperatures the remainder of the night tonight with readings only dipping into the middle 60s tomorrow. It looks like a gorgeous day sunshine from start to finish. It will be warm and it will be breezy. It looks like again afternoon highs well into the 80s tomorrow afternoon and it looks like the same reasons why we're going to have a quiet day tomorrow will be the reason why we have a quiet day on Friday. We're going to have this ridge of high pressure in the jet stream positioned right overhead. The storm track will be moving up and around that ridge of high pressure well north of the Ozark so we don't have to worry about any stormy weather over the next couple of days. It will be quiet and it will be very warm. Actually perfect weather to get out and enjoy the Ozarks. Maybe do some floating, maybe do some fishing. Overnight tonight, we'll hold on to starry skies. Temperatures will drop to about 64 for low in Springfield. <laughs> Highs tomorrow, mid to upper 80s. It looks like about 86 in Springfield, but there are gonna be some backyards that hit 87 tomorrow afternoon. Lake Ozark, I think it's gonna be one of those spots. Fort Leonard Wood, maybe Mountain Home. Winds breezy out of the southwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Now, all week long, I've been eyeing this pattern shift as we get into this upcoming weekend. And this is a, a pattern which often leads to the potential of stormy weather over the midsection of the country. And I think we are going to find that. This appears to be a fairly classic severe weather setup for our region. The Gulf of Mexico wide open. It's going to be sending Gulf of Mexico moisture, Gulf of Mexico instability north into the Ozarks. Meanwhile, we're going to have this trough in the western U.S. and around that trough, we're going to have a couple of potent storms which are going to lift out toward the northeast across the midsection of the country. And they're going to come out in a fashion that typically produces some severe weather. And it looks like there's going to be a broad area impacted by that severe weather potential uh, from Saturday through Wednesday of next week from Texas right across the Ozarks into the Ohio Valley. Here's what I'm expecting locally. Again, a classic stormy weather setup for us. Two main waves of severe weather Sunday, uh, Saturday afternoon into Saturday night and then again Tuesday afternoon into Tuesday night. All modes of severe weather will be possible. So right now we can enjoy the quiet, but be weather aware this weekend. Again, Thursday and Friday, lots of sunshine, highs in the mid 80s. Saturday uh, looks like we'll see an increasing chance for showers and thunderstorms as we work into the afternoon and overnight. Some of those storms could be severe, quiet on Sunday. A chance for storms maybe Monday night. Can't rule out severe weather there. Uh, and then again on Tuesday afternoon, Tuesday night, I do expect another round of very active weather. We'll be watching for sure. Jamie, how about our viewers club number? Uh, number tonight, 158-448, jackpot $800. All right, Jamie, thank you. Coming up, stick around because an honor flight just returned to the Ozarks. We'll have video of that homecoming. Plus, farmers using technology to save their crops during the summer.